Pablo Gunner here for a nerdy fitness vlog. It feels like it's been a really long time, which maybe it has. And so here's the deal. I was uh, I was sick for a little bit, and I also went on a trip to Pagosa Springs. Uh, the wife and I had a little getaway, and it was really, really interesting because I did not work out the whole time, and I actually felt like I looked really good. Like, obviously, I wasn't getting more defined or more, you know, bigger, more muscular or anything like that, but I was just, I wouldn't eat. We wouldn't eat unless we, we wouldn't go out to eat unless we were hungry. And so it was this great thing that worked because we also, we split every, almost everything except for one meal that ended up as leftovers. It was huge portions, very expensive, huge portions, very good too. But so yeah, it, it was nice because we shared everything the wife and I and so it ended up being the perfect amount and we even had like we had a lot of bad stuff like we had a lot of uh, ice cream well it wasn't like big things ice cream we got like the super mini ice creams and that's what we had for like watching movies but even then like it was like as dessert you know after we ate and it was we didn't eat it just to eat it we ate like I said if we were hungry so like I said I felt like I looked really good checking myself out in the mirror as I do uh, throughout the trip and stuff so yeah so it just it went to prove and it go, went to show hey I don't have to work out as long as I eat right for the most part so you know proven right there so uh, but anyways I wanted to do last night I came into work early to do work out and I did my you know, my, my ex training, which is the yoga and the, um, and then the mostly like upper body cardio stuff, but also some lower body, but mostly. And so I wanted to do legs in the morning when I got off, but unfortunately I had some training to do that written it, it would require taking a test or a couple tests and they took a couple hours so and um, and I got off like almost uh, with like about an hour of, of OT that's on average so that's not out of the norm um, and it, I, it was really nice it was really nice how things worked out I called this person I said hey can I get relieved early I have this test to go take they're like hey I'll do my best you know boom the guy one of the guys was like hey well I'm this you know your relief is not but I'm his relief so I'll go relieve him I just need a ride can you give me a ride gave him a ride his you know my relief came out boom it just worked out so smoothly and so nicely and it's like this is how it should work like a well-oiled machine everybody does what they're supposed to you know it was fantastic good communication everything worked out you know that's that's I, I love that I love that stuff so anyways like I said, it took me a while to do the test though, so I didn't get out until I get off, because technically the, the schedule is from like 11 to 7, but like I said, we usually get at least an hour of OT, so it ends up being 8 on norm, but like I said, I didn't get off until 11 because of the tests, so, uh, so yeah, I did that, and... It was, it was, you know, it was fine. Um, but the biggest problem was that I didn't eat during my, like, I did eat, but this is what happened. Okay, so I wasn't really hungry for my workout, which I destroyed. I, I was just, like, fantastic. I know it's yoga, but, like, the rest of it, I totally, you know, destroyed it. It was awesome. So, felt good, felt fantastic, but I wasn't hungry, so I didn't eat. And so, it worked out really well. I didn't, I, you know, and then I had, to, I gave this guy a break an hour break and I was like okay I'll warm up my food the wife made me a couple pieces of salmon and green beans so that's what I ate is these small pieces of salmon and some green beans and it hit the spot it was great and then I was like oh, I'm hungry but I don't know how long it's gonna take me to do this test I thought maybe it was just an hour and so it wasn't the case it took me a couple hours so I that's that's how it goes sometimes and 
So I was like, man, I'm so starving. I did have uh, nectarine while I was there testing, but like even that, like by the time I got off, I was still starving. So I was like, I do not have the energy to do a hardcore legs workout right now. So I was like, forget it, I'm, I'm going home. Besides, and I was gonna, I was supposed to go get comics today too, from Twin Sons. And, and age of comics if I had time, but at least twins. And I couldn't because I just got off. Well, I, I bullshitted with uh, you know one of my buddies from from my class uh, at my work class, like that we did training together and stuff. So yeah, and, and so I ended up being like it was like a solid 30 minutes we were talking. So I didn't. I I am just about to get home now, and it's almost one, which is late for me. So I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna upload the video for the Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry, and then I'm going to sleep. So I'll throw. So I'm throwing that up there. Uh, Comic Cast is up for 200 or for 299. But I'm wondering what should I do? Actually, this video will probably come out after we do Comic Cast 300. But I'm curious still what we should do for Comic Cast 300. Should we, like, of course I'm going to give away all kinds of digital comics, but I feel like I, I want to give away comics for something, not just, I mean, I'll probably give random comics away, but how about for each question a person asks, you get a comic, or I'll, I'll give away a comic. I mean, I'll give a comic to the person that asks it, but I'll also give away random comics, so it's not just, you know, people can show up just randomly and people don't have to ask questions, but people who ask questions will get more comics, get more free digital comics. Uh, but what other kind of stuff should we do for our 300th comic book podcast? I tried to get uh, I tried to get uh, Scott Schneider to to do a little soundbite or or do a phone in, but he's too busy with metal now, so can't. I don't blame him. You know, I don't blame him. Hey, you know, you're a big deal. I'm not. I'm nobody. You know, and not only that, like you're busy working on on all these comics, so. And, uh, yeah. So, anyways. So, yeah. Um, that's it. So, uh, stay nerdy, my friends. Oh, yeah. Stay fit. Stay healthy. Love and peace.